this is what they consider um, rehabilitation. This is what the parole board says. I need more of this. Ohio is a southern state. We just geographically happen to be located in the north. I never really had my own apartment. I never had a, a, a savings account. I went from having enrolled in college to several months later to being in prison. 50,000 people in prison today in Ohio. That's an absurd number for the crime rate we have in Ohio. In 1996, the state legislature changed the, the sentencing law. It created two class of inmates, and as an old law inmate, it was very hard. You got two classes of people who committed the same crime, and yet they're, they're serving disproportionate sentences. Suddenly, the pro board starts keeping them for 20, 25 years. The system refuses to acknowledge that that difference is dangerous. If I was to go into the general population, I feel that I wouldn't make it. It's not about rehabilitation. It's not about corrections. This is human farming. The huge failure of the new law is it incentivizes zero change. I compare the disparity to the, the crack cocaine versus um, powder cocaine sentencing disparity. The only way to fix it is to do away with the old law. Fix them all. So everybody's got a new sentence. I feel like we are being left behind now. That's what the decision is. We're just delaying crime for our kids. And that's a bad choice. At the last second, I just said, put me on suicide watch. You slip, sanity wise. I have to basically walk on eggshells and it's like navigating my way through the jungle and um, I'm a gazelle. I mean, I call it the invisible chest mat. I can't even really defend myself in this environment. Like they said, ain't no fun when the rabbit got the shotgun. <laughs>